Good evening, my brothers and sisters, or good afternoon. Um, Vicki here coming to you from Southeast Central Kansas. The Washroom Report. We have some breaking developments. It is Monday, September 21st, 2020. Um, let's see. Let's jump into it. Coming out of Depco file, it seems that the high-ranking officials of Sudan um, are meeting currently with uh, UAE officials and the United States high-ranking officials um, in this peace and security project uh, perpetrated by one President Donald J. Trump. Um, they are meeting in Abu Dhabi. Okay, um, this is unprecedented because we know that Sudan is uh, one of the players in the Ezekiel 38 war. Amen. Uh, Sudan, Ethiopia, same same place. Okay. Um, so in return for said peace, um, the... Um, high-ranking officials of Sudan are wanting approximately $3 billion. And uh, in return, that President Donald Trump would move, remove Sudan as um, a terrorist state. Okay? And not only do they want $3 billion, they also want constant uh, funds for aid. Okay. Um, don't be deceived, my brothers and sisters in Christ. This is all a faux peace, okay? Fake peace. There will be no peace until the Prince of Peace, the Lord Jesus Christ, steps his feet upon the Mount of Olives. Amen. Also happening today, um, uh, Israeli Defense Force uh, General and acting uh, halfway Prime Minister of Israel, uh, Benny Gantz, is currently on his way to Washington, to the Pentagon. Now, call me stupid, but nobody goes to the Pentagon unless we are uh, getting ready for war. Okay, and I'm not talking about war games. I'm talking about war. And also, um, President Trump is trying to uh, also have uh, some peace ties with Lebanon and Israel. Really? You can't have peace with Hezbollah. Okay? There's no peace with terrorists. Amen? Um... But that's what I got for you today. Uh, things are heating up. Um, I love you guys. Jesus loves us. The Spirit and the Bride say come. If you have never called upon the name of the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, please do so now. 1 Corinthians um, 5. Is it 5? Verses 1 through 4, I believe. Um, states that... Um, Jesus died on the cross for your sins, exactly as the scriptures proclaim, and God the Father raised him from the grave three days later. And all who put their faith and hope and trust in the one true Mashiach, Mashi um, Messiah, um, are saved. Okay? Uh, John 3, 16 says, Whoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Okay, call upon the name of the Lord while he may yet still be found because the rapturo, the harpazo of the bride of Christ, the believing are leaving in an instant, in the blink of an eye, while they are saying peace and safety, while they are saying it. They're saying it all over the place, but in the background, it is different. We got, like I said, Benny Gantz on his way to the Pentagon. Okay? Heads up, brothers and sisters. We'll talk soon. Love you guys.